Hi everyone, welcome back to another weekly shopping haul. This week I went to Costco and I also need to pop to one of the supermarkets. I don't know what one yet at this point. Today is Wednesday the 24th of June, it's my birthday eve. I don't celebrate birthday eve, I'm just... I'm just saying it's my birthday eve and also in the spirit of birthdays there's a few treats in here for my, my day off. I'm having a day off on Sunday so there's a few treats in that in there for that. Anyway I'm blethering. I'll show you what I got from Costco. I got one of these big massive bags of the chicken breast. I got these last month and oh my god they were so good. They didn't last as long as I thought they were going to last because we had people over in the garden for fajitas and stuff and we had barbecues. What is it? It's two, just under three kilos it is. and I think I'd, I counted that it was going to do like seven dinners for three of us so I thought it was really good and they are actually really delicious chicken breasts as well. So we're talking about birthday treats, there's a few maybe birthday treats in this video but these, Ali's going to be cooking for me on Sunday and I have to choose what I want to eat. So, I, I, I mean, I really don't have much a clue what I want, but I thought, oh my God, they sounded so nice. Mac and cheese croquettes. I actually want macaroni cheese, like proper macaroni cheese, but Ali is not that advanced a cook yet, like to make homemade macaroni cheese. I will get round to showing him at some point, so maybe by my next birthday or next Mother's Day or something, he can cook me proper macaroni and cheese. But because he's not got the cooking skills yet, I thought, oh, these sound perfect. Mac and cheese croquettes. I think these were, uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually just going to put the prices on top um, of the video so I don't have to keep trying to remember <laughs> what all the prices were. And I also got, oh my God, how good do these look? Jalapeno flamers. They're green jalapeno peppers filled with cream cheese and a natural breadcrumb. And do you know what? These look like, they look like they're the same ones that they get at one of my local takeaways, which is actually sadly closing down. And they, they look like they're the ones that they get. And they're delicious. They're the best jalapeno poppers in the world. Well, not that I've tried every one in the world, but we love them. Ali and I love them. So I thought I'll get them to try. Hopefully they're good, but if not, cheese, jalapeno, natural breadcrumbs. It's going to be delicious, whatever way it goes. I've also been eyeing these up the last couple of times that I've been in Costco. as like a treat for Ali or something. But I got them, um, what did I get them? The first time I got them chocolate crepes and the last time I got them like the waffles and he's still got some of the waffles, it's, it definitely. So I decided to get them these this time. This is his little proper treat from Costco this time. Little cookie dough balls. They're like ice cream bites. These ones are chalk chip and these ones are triple chocolate. And they also, I'm sure they've done mango, like um, a more summery variety of these as well non-chocolatey variety as well but i can't remember i know ali likes chocolate so i just picked up the ones i also got 90 large refuse sacks we go through so many of these especially at the minute because we're bagging up the garden waste and all that as well so these were desperately needed got a big bag of pretzels these are little snacky things for Ali. We have been sitting down in the afternoons watching some documentaries. At the minute it's documentaries about World War II um, and he's been just having a little bowl of the, I think it was just lightly salted pretzels that I got from Poundland or Home Bargains or somewhere but I got these. I thought these will last them a bit longer and yeah even though school's going to be over by the end of this week that you're watching this we're hopefully still going to be able to watch some documentaries in that stop his brain wasting away so he'll still need little snacky bits or for movie nights and stuff like that. I've got a big massive pack of these dinner rolls. It's 36 for 3 49 I mean it's really good and they're delicious. I love these. Mark's gran, anytime we go out to hers and we have dinner there, she always gives us these. She just keeps them in our freezer so I thought, you know what, I want these on my birthday with my mac and cheese bites and my jalapeno flamers. I want maybe a couple of these. I mean, they're quite diddy ones. And the rest, I'm just going to divide them up and put them in freezer bags and that. Give them a alley for when he has soups and stuff like that. Or I might give some to one of my brothers because maybe they won't all fit in my freezer. Might not have the space at the minute. I also got a 12-pack of chopped tomatoes. And I got some... Non-stick baking parchment. I know I got this last month when I went, or what was it, three or four weeks ago I went. I got this and my mum needs some. She requested me to get some of this for her. So that's for her. It's not for me. I've not run out of that baking parchment I got a couple of weeks ago already. I got a big massive sack of potatoes. How big was this sack? What does it say? 15 kilos, I think it is. 15 kilos of potatoes because I'm always... I use 
too many potatoes probably but I've been running out recently I've not been buying enough so I thought I'm going to get a sack and hopefully I won't run out soon oh my god this was my complete impulse buy I saw the name Ghirardelli chocolate and I was like oh god I have to get this this Ghirardelli I don't know if any of you guys know is a well I watch a lot of Disney vlogs and Ghirardelli is a chocolate shop at Disney Springs in Florida and Costco apparently are selling some of their stuff now oh, well I say some of their stuff but I know I haven't seen anything else apart from this but this is like a ready made chocolate brownie mix so you just add water or something to it got different recipes to make other stuff on the side this is a four pack it's a four pack so it says 2.26 kilos that's how heavy it is it is quite heavy it's a massive box but it is a four pack and i checked the use by date the use by date was where is it was it on the bottom the use by date was like 20 oh 11 21 so it's going to last oh god that's so heavy it's going to last forever and i know ali's going to flip and love them it's for him to make cookies for himself and his dad and cousins or whatever i might i might get him to make them on sunday and maybe i could have one with my birth as my birthday cake <laughs> Um, ice and sugar that's from my mum she wanted me to get that we've not been able to find that anywhere else so that was three kilos it was pretty cheap i got a massive bottle of ranch because ali loves this i bought him it just a few weeks ago when i got a bottle from asda for him to try and he absolutely loved it so i got a big bottle i know it's not going to go to waste and it's 52 fluid ounces wait there 1.53 liters so hopefully that'll last a while i'm going to try and you know make sure that he doesn't tan it in one go oh black pepper they had herbs and spices this time more than just the salt that i could see last time so i've got a black pepper grinder and it has a refill that's going to last forever i also got a big massive tub of cumin because i go through that a lot same with the chopped onion and i got turmeric i don't grow through that as much as I do these ones, but I knew I'd ran out and I needed to buy more, so I just bought a big tub while I was there. Last time I was at Costco, I bought some of these pickled gherkins and they were gone, like I said, within the fortnight. They were gone within the fortnight, so I needed to get more of them. I also got a cooked chicken that we're going to have that for dinner tonight. You would have seen us have it in last week's Meals of the Week. These are so delicious. And I also got the potatoes. These potatoes, I know I've got these ones, but I wanted to make some potato salad. And these little salad potatoes are brilliant for that. It's two kilos. It was really cheap, like one pound something for these. Um, yeah, and obviously they're not all going to do for the one meal. We'll use them in other meals, but I just wanted some of them to go with my chicken. I've got a big bag of spinach. I'm loving spinach at the minute. It's my thing that I'm obsessed with. Next week it'll be something else probably, but this week it's spinach. The last couple of weeks it's been spinach. A bag of these little cucumbers. These are for Ali. He, I mean, I will maybe have one or two if I can get to them before he has the whole bag to himself. But I got him these last month and he absolutely loved them. And last month when I went to Costco, I filmed a come shot with me. I didn't do one this one because I actually went while I was in the middle of painting my bathroom. So I really didn't have much time to do any come shop with me or that. I really just wanted to get around Costco quickly. So I will do one next time I go. But last time I done a come shop with me and I was like, oh, I don't know if Ali will like that or not. I'll have to see if he does. So when I showed him the video, he's like, ah, get me one, get me one. So I got him one of them. That'll be his lunch for the next, oh, I don't know, maybe two or three days. Also got a big massive tub of the Oxo cubes. I go through so many of these and they're free on Summer Mold. So I put them in a lot of stuff like spaghetti bolognese chili oh god loads of stuff loads of stuff another thing that i've been obsessing about recently is strawberries so i went ahead and bought a massive pack this is like just under a kilo yeah 907 grams so i thought it worked out more cost efficient to buy this than the whatever it is that you get at tesco what 400 grams for three pounds or something i think this is about four or five pounds so yeah, more strawberries. And they'll be gone in a few days. They'll be gone by the time this video comes out. In fact, so will the cucumber, so will the broccoli salad, so will the spinach. The gherkins will be making our dent and definitely. Anyway, that was everything that I got from Costco. And I will show you what else I got at the shops. I'm either going to go to Tesco or Asda, so I'll show you that now. So I did also pop into Tesco this week just to get a few mostly fresh stuff and a few other bits and bobs that were needed. I did pick up some of these flavoured waters for Ali. I'm trying to encourage them not to drink all the iron brew. 
Um, it is sugar free iron brew, so I was like, I don't mind I'm drinking it, but he's drinking tons of it at the minute, especially this past week because the weather has been so hot and we keep it in the fridge and he's just been devouring it. Like, I'm almost out already and I don't want to buy another pack, so I'm like, Ali, you're drinking this water. So I got him a Mac B strawberry and kiwi one. I just got him different ones to try and see what he likes. The orange and mango one, oh, that's a sparkling one from Tesco. And then I got him plum and pear. That sounds lovely. And what was this? This is the Nestle Pure Life Marvelous Mango and Pineapple. So I just got him a few to try. I know I got a whole pack of chopped tomatoes at Costco, but I also need some passata. I use passata quite a lot. I probably use it actually more than I use chopped tomatoes these days, especially when Mark's staying with us because he picks out the chopped tomatoes. He picks out the actual bits of tomato. So this is actually just makes life easier for me and him at the minute. I got some vegetable oil. <laughs> Not for me. It's for the brownies, the Ghirardella brownies. They require a little tablespoon or something of vegetable oil and name. So Ali's going to make them this weekend. I got a Candarel Sugarly. I got two of these. These look so nice. They're fat-free garlic and chives uh, salad dressing and they were actually on clearance price for 63p, 67p or something like that. And the best before date is, isn't until like the 12th of January 2021. So hopefully I'll have used them. Hopefully they're delicious. I've never tried them before, but they're completely sin free as well. Also got a tin of Spam. Mark and I were talking about Spam the other day. He says he loves it so much. So I got that to keep for meals that Ali and I are going to have that he's not very keen on. And we are going to have like the taco casserole this week, which he doesn't mind, but I've actually put too many beans and vegetables in that in it for him. So, well, for his liking, because he's, he's funny with vegetables in that. So I think I might give him that when we have our taco casserole this week. I got one, one, look at this, a little one bag of coffee pods. I got these, oh, these are just a treat for my granny. I got her these the very first time she was in hospital back in February. And she absolutely loved them. She's like, oh, I've not had these for years. And she loved them. And there is a few issues we are eating in that at the minute. So I want to get her something that I know she's definitely going to eat. So they're for granny. We're going to have fajitas this week. So I've got some tortilla wraps for Mark and Ali. I think I'm just going to have lettuce wraps. Um, tortilla chips to put on top of the taco casseroles. Um, I don't know if I'm going to put it on mine, but I know Ali will definitely want it on his. A garlic bulb that should be over there. <laughs> uh, steak bakes again, something else for Mark that he can have. I don't know what is it. Oh, spinach and bacon pasta. We're going to have. I don't think that he'll like. So I've got him steak bakes to have with him and instead of that. Sorry, some dry kitten food for the cats. The have this for their breakfast and their supper. They have the wet stuff for their actual dinner, their main course. <laughs> um, I got two bags of the 50% reduced fat cheddar. I hadn't even used my last bag of reduced fat cheddar from Asda, but when I went into the fridge, I, why did I get it two or three weeks ago? I went into the fridge to use it the other day and it was going mouldy. Like, I don't understand why it was already going mouldy. That's, cheese should last a lot longer than that. So hopefully this will last a little bit longer. So they were two for three pound. A cheese and garlic bread. This is to have with, on Sunday for Ali to cook. Um, along with the mac and cheese bites and the, what was it? The jalapeno poppers. These are another treat for me. I'll give one to Ali. But I think these are like five cents or five and a half cents. So I fancy one of these. I saw them. I was like, oh, I've not had them since the first time I was on Slimmer World in 2017. And I remember I used to have these quite often as a little treat. So they're nice. They're really nice. The toffee cream meringues. A car and the soya milk. I actually had to run into Tesco the other day and pick up another couple because I ran out. So I only need one at the minute. I'll get more on throughout the week. I also got another tub of fat-free cottage cheese. I nearly got two because I have been eating this quite a lot. Like a tub lasts maybe two days if I'm lucky. But I just got one because, I don't know, I just got one. And I got two tubs of fat-free quark. Can't quite remember why I need that right now, but I've got two. <laughs> we needed butter uh, for Mark and Ali mostly. And yeah, just need, got, a, got a tub of the reduced fat butter pack from Tesco. Um, Halloumi, Ali asked me what I want for, he's going to make me breakfast in bed 
for my birthday Sunday and he asked me what I wanted and I wanted halloumi bagels so I just got a packet of halloumi you seen that garlic? <laughs> the pineapples were on offer for 49p each so I got two because that is such a good price and I also got a little watermelon, the tiniest little watermelon um, but I really just wanted to get one. I didn't want to go into any other shops and I should have got one when I was at Tesco the other day but, sorry, Costco the other day. I should have got one when I was at Costco. But honestly, that one was too big. I probably could not have fit that in my fridge. I also got a packet of Golden Delicious Apples for Ali. He's loving these at the minute. All chopped up with some cinnamon sprinkled on top. Um, bananas for Ali. Little Satsumas, or sorry, Sweet Easy Peelers. I thought I picked up Clementines, but little oranges because I'm loving them. A bag of onions, I got sweet gem lettuce, I was wanting romaine lettuce but they didn't have any so I just got a little sweet gem one. This is mostly to have for my fajitas, I'm going to just put them in the lettuce leaves. And then I got a punnet of baby plum tomatoes and one of cherry tomatoes and a packet of mushrooms. And that was all the groceries that I got this week. Please like this video if you enjoyed it, subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you next time.